He was 210 pounds. Good job! He was just huge. There was no other way to describe him. I just felt bad for him. You know I'm gonna take him. He was really quiet and, and fairly reserved. He was at the park for the first time. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. Come on, Woody. We would just go halfway around the block. Good, good boy. Oh, tricks. <laughs> You're like, get me that. <laughs> Stay. Stay. And then as he got more and more fit, we would go off leash dog park. And then as he got more fit and I got a little braver with knowing his personality, then I would take all three of them. Come on, Woody. Woody, come this way. You can do it. You can do it. Atta boy. Good job. He loves to be outside. You want to go for a walk, Woody? Canadian winters are in Edmonton are not exactly balmy, like we're usually really cold and he loves the cold weather. Sit. That's a very good boy. He's a really funny, personable dog. He talks incessantly. Woody. Oh. Hey, Woody. Oh. Oh. He was really difficult to get on to eating his prescription food. Eventually, he got to where he no longer thought it was horrible. Do you want your supper? At home, his treats are, you know, bananas and carrots. At first, was like, what the heck is this? If you're cooking, he is right there. He loves his walks, like he's the one that he starts chortling in the car, he starts calling as soon as he gets even close, he knows where he's going. If he has something in his mind, there's no turning that off. What if I want to just... Home! What if I want to... Oh, home! And I love his excitement with life. So he was 210 when he started, and yesterday he was 152. It's walking every day, it's monitoring their food intake and making sure they eat healthily, and literally that is what we've done. We want him as healthy as possible before he's ready for adoption. He's an old dude, he's gone through a lot of change. And I really do think old dogs can learn new tricks because he's just done amazingly well. Are you excited or not? Are you excited or not?